In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a simple slit wood. I'm going to be using sculpt gel and I'm just having part A and part B and then I mix this together in equal parts. Make sure not to mix too much so that you can apply it in different layers. So I'm just adding out the shape and then I'm blending out my edges. And using a slightly blunt object, I'm just cutting away some of the excess. Here I'm just scraping everything off, I'm not actually cutting the product. And I just keep blending and adding more product until I'm happy with the look. And as usual, you can find all the products listed down below. You can get different types of sculpt gel and you can even order some from me in my Etsy store. The different brands are usually Sculpt Gel, Third Degree and Cryolan Artex which is used. Make sure to let each layer dry in between and especially before you powder everything down. Now I'm just using quite a neutral powder to set everything. Using alcohol paint for this look but you can also switch it out with grease paint although it won't sit as well. So I'm just using that alcohol paint to fill in the red and then I am just applying a very light layer around it to make it look more irritated. For this step I'm just using the color primary red. And then I'm just deepening a little bit with some darker paints. And then I'm just adding a little bit of bruise tone to deepen the look and make it look more realistic. Here I'm adding some fake pus to make the wound look more irritated. The product is quite gel-like, so I'm just applying some blobs and dragging them out, making sure not to cover the entire wound with the pus. And then I'm adding some medium darkness fake blood, and this is gonna make it look quite fresh, but still not freshly cut fresh. And here you got the finished result. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you get use of this tutorial. Make sure to give it a like if you liked it, and subscribe if you want to see more. And I'm doing 16 videos in October, so I'm gonna link my Halloween 2017 playlist below if you want to watch.